Hello you guys, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're doing something brand new. Yeah. We're gonna do a review of a baby product. Oh. What? Oh. If you guys know us at all, if you've been watching any of our videos, you know we love a bargain. Mm -hmm. But also, I feel like we both love good quality. Yeah. We love a bargain, but we love good quality. So when it came to baby stuff, as we started kind of researching in baby equipment and things, yeah. there's so much stuff you need for a baby. When we got to diaper bags, Josh kind of lost his mind. Yeah. Because I started showing him the ones that I liked, that I thought were really pretty, because there are so many ugly diaper bags that, like, sure, it's fine. Whatever. It doesn't have to be cute. It's a diaper bag. But I wanted it to be cute. So I started showing him the ones that I thought were cute. It's like, there's no way that you should have to pay that much money for a diaper bag. Mm -hmm. But we do want multiple kids, we think. <laughs> we'll see how this first one goes. I would love if the diaper bag could last through multiple children. So I want it good quality and I want it to be something that I'm not gonna hate picking up every day where I'm like, this is so ugly. I hate that I have to carry this around. I don't know. I think that's fair. For Mother's Day, I got her the diaper bag she wanted. I bought it on Amazon, not on their website. All the Amazon reviews were comparing this diaper bag to this diaper bag. <laughs> <laughs> oh, as you can see, they look very similar. Very, very similar. The one that I really wanted from a brand called Fawn Design. It's really high quality, but they are fairly expensive. This diaper bag is $170, which is kind of ridiculous. Like, I'll admit that. There's diaper bags at Target, 100 bucks, that aren't cute at all. And I think, personally, that this is very beautiful. The shocking thing is this. So this is called Miss Fong, and I found out about it only through Amazon reviews. This is only 50 bucks. So, so it's literally a third of the price. Yeah. Just by looking at them, you can't really tell the difference. Yeah. We have not actually used this as a diaper bag. Yeah. So this is literally <laughs> just based on look, feel, all of that. We have no experience for longevity or how it actually functions as a diaper bag. Just keep that in mind. Let's start with this one. So I'm just gonna talk about kind of the outside features on this one, and then we'll talk about the outside features on this one. We've got a nice little handle here that you can grab. There's also straps to make it a backpack, which I think is amazing. So it's beautiful, like gold hardware. It all seems really nice, like there's no squeaking. Listen. Heavy feeling hardware. Yeah, so it seems not like, it like last. cheapy. A this really, really big pocket back here. And in the back here, there's also a little zipper pocket, which I like. And that goes all the way to the end. And these zippers just feel really nice. Like they don't catch at all. On both sides, there's pockets here. So for, I don't know, water or bottles. <laughs> Two really nice large pockets on each side. There's a pocket in here as well as a zipper pocket. So on the outside, just so many pockets. So that's what the outside of this one looks like. Everything about it feels well made. So this one obviously looks very similar. First thing, when you pick this one up, it doesn't feel quite as buttery soft. Mm -hmm. On the back, it's almost identical design. It has this pouch with hidden straps. The straps on this one are the same like vegan leather material. The straps on this one are webbing. I think all the hardware isn't quite as heavy, but it still feels really nice on this. I think it would last. And you can see the hooks that it goes into aren't the like thick hooks. Mm -hmm like font design. They still seem really nice. So you can see on the inside of the font design one, it's that sort of vegan leather all the way through. This one, you'll see on all the insides, it's like a nylon or something. Yeah. Material in here. More like, like waterproof. Yeah. It also has that zipper. Oh, this actually has two zippers and they're both like full width. And then on the front, there are the same sort of three pockets to put bottles and then one in the front. It also has this one here like the font design, but it actually adds two more pockets as well into these side ones. They're pretty narrow, so I'm not yeah. quite sure what you would fit in here, but. These kind of just remind me of like girl jean pockets where like they're <laughs> there, but they're not really useful. Let's get into it. Literally. So, so inside, it's all that same material. So it does come with a shoulder strap. So I'm guessing that's what hooks on these. There's the main big pocket here and then all around the sides, there's these pockets that you can put like wipes or diapers or snacks or whatever you need in those. And then there's a pocket on the back as well as a zipper 
in front. So a good amount of storage in here and it's just so massive. I'm not really planning on bringing a separate purse around with me. If I'm carrying this around, I'm just gonna kind of throw that stuff in one of these pockets and that's like my pocket. Oh, it's just too many bags. My purse is like this big. So I don't like carrying a large bag. So that's why I thought, okay, if I'm gonna have to carry one, I want it to be pretty. So like a pacifier clip or something, it's got like one little hook in here. Not totally sure, but I'm guessing that's maybe what that's for. Opening this one, it is not that vegan leather stuff on the inside. It's more of like a nylon material or something. Listen. Yeah, it's that kind of material. This like, could be better because it's kind of waterproofy. Guessing that my child is gonna poop inside the diaper bag, but <laughs> if something spills, this yeah. might be easier to clean off. I yeah. don't know. But this actually comes with more accessories inside. This has a changing pad, Look which is kind of cute. Yeah, so small, and it's again kind of a classy look on the outside. This also comes with a strap. I don't know what this is for. Pacifier clips for the outside. And then there's a pacifier clip on like a longer thing on this one. Now for number of pockets. This one was actually shocking when I opened it. It has so many pockets. Yeah, it's got four down here. It's got a zipper pocket right here. One really big zipper across the back, one little pouch thing, and another like smaller zipper across the back. Is this one insulated? Yeah, there's two insulated. Oh, for like juice or a bottle or something? Yeah, there's two insulated pockets. So that has a lot of organization. Those are kind of the features mm -hmm. of them. So I do appreciate that they're trying to give a more affordable option. Just when I pick it up, this one just feels so much nicer. You can't argue with that. True. However, for a third of the price, this is a great option, I think. Yeah. I don't know how it holds up. The reviews online were really, really good. Reviews online for both of these are very good. I can't decide if I like the finally material in this or the full leather inside of this. I think this one looks nicer on the mm -hmm. inside, but I don't know which one is actually more user-friendly. User friendly. Yeah. If I were picking one, I would pick this. Value yeah. for the money will likely last as long as this, and it's a third of the price. If they were both the same price, then I would pick this, because I think this does feel nicer. It's very subtle, and I don't think that it's probably worth three times as much, but I really like it, and most other things we're buying for this baby, we're getting the less expensive option. We still want it to be nice and everything, but this is something I'm gonna be carrying around every single day, or you're going to be carrying around every single day. We're just gonna have it with us constantly. And so I want it to be something that I really actually like. This one, I like, it's fine. But I think in the back of my mind, I'd always be thinking about the higher end version of it. We will be keeping the Fawn Design bag. No good reason, other than <laughs> that's the one that other I decided I like. Nicer. It's okay to splurge, it was a Mother's Day gift. Comment down below which diaper bag you guys would choose or if you have other diaper bags that you like or you use with kids in the past. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up for us. You guys are great and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.